New details in a tough love plan to end homelessness. Roar City Council members will vote on proposals to tackle this problem. Matt Marr joining us now with a deep dive into this proposal. Matt. Erica, several plans are on the table for a vote tonight, and it comes after Aurora's mayor saying in a recent op-ed, homelessness is a top issue and requires a long-term strategy. Aurora City Council taking several approaches to tackle this issue in ways they say will be different than Denver. First, a change to Aurora's court system. A proposed program called the Heart Program will be set up for people who are homeless and facing low-level offenses. That stands for Housing, Employment, Assistance, Recovery, and Teamwork. It's basically a probation system for people who are homeless that offers support and will allow them to stay in it for a year, then get their charges dropped. Another plan would toughen up existing camping bans in the city and make it so people camping along the I-225 corridor get a ticket and a court date. Right now, they get a 72-hour notice to move. The mayor says they're also offered services, but few take advantage of them. It's a tough love approach in the sense that uh, we're going to be more aggressive about getting people off the street, um, but also more aggressive about getting them into the resources that they need, uh, whether it's addiction recovery, mental health, uh, job training, uh, whatever. The mayor says Aurora has about 300 people living on the streets, and most of them are off that I-225 corridor. The media is expected to begin in about an hour and a half at 630. We'll let you know what happens with the vote. Jeremy. All right.